It is said that probably one of the most important words in management or even in leadership is communication. I think it's even more than that because communication is about connection and how can you be part of anything if you're not connected with that thing and everything around us you know is one entity we're all form one entity I mean look at the human species look at us and nature look at you know planet earth with the solar system so look at the solar system with the you know with the galaxy our galaxy and look at our galaxy in relationship you know in relation with other galaxies and the universe so you can go from the you know cosmic level to the subatomic particles within an atom it's all they're all dancing together through a certain you know rhythm determined by whatever physics and and the laws of nature so we're all together and the way we remain together and the way we interact with each other is through connection and communication is one of the keys of connection so communication is you know is take out communication there's no life take out communication there's no organization there are no societies so it's at the heart that's why mastering communication is you know one of the most fundamental pillars of exercising leadership or playing a management managerial role or even surviving in an organization or being part of a team now communication is a science or an art form the way I mean define it the way you want um, by itself and it will take you know people spend their life mastering this skill and my advice to you is you know any opportunity you have to improve the, your level of communication do that because it's a vast space because you know there's so many different tools and techniques to do that what's important for you to understand is that communication happens in different forms so we've established that communication is paramount without it you don't even exist right I mean in, as, as a part of an entity you can't belong without communicating in some way or form uh, and that you have to understand that there are many different levels and ways of communication now a smart thing to do is to be aware of the appropriate means of communication that is needed for the appropriate you know entity appropriate people in an in a defined situation so in a work environment or in an organizational environment the environment itself will determine what's the best form of communication and the situation by itself sometimes it's face to face sometimes it's through technology sometimes through text sometimes through I don't know video or all these video conferencing techniques sometimes um, through gestures sometimes through nonverbal communication sometimes you know actions speak louder than words sometimes no you need to have the proper words so mastering communication is absolutely you know fundamental and I can't think of anybody who wants to you know proceed and progress and develop in their career whether it's related to management or you know in exercising leadership without mastering this art because one of the greatest sources of strength is being able to communicate and articulate your thoughts and ideas and feelings and whatever you want to share with others in a clear and effective way this is gold this is this is you know I can't even overemphasize the importance of this that's why as much as you can learn how to articulate yourself in an intelligent and smart way the more you do that the more effective you will be as a manager or as somebody who is exercising leadership and even without this you know leadership and management even take these put them on the side you need to know how to articulate your thoughts and your feelings with others so that you can survive and thrive you need to do that and once you've do you've done that 
your career, your profession, your position in life, your position in society, the nature of your relationships, the depths of your relationships, the opportunities that will open for you, the way your solutions, you know, will be, your problems will be solved through proper solutions, will all open up in a, in a, in a, in a beautiful way. So invest in communication and understand its importance and apply different communication techniques that are required in different, situ different situations for different you know, circumstances and conditions and with different people and entities. I can't go through details now. I don't want to go through specifics because this subject has no end, relatively speaking, or, or metaphorically speaking. Right? But what I'm interested in is that you get this idea into your mind. Become a master communicator. Do that. Don't miss any opportunity to improve on these skills. It will open up, you know, the doors of the future for you. And if you're in charge of people, help them do that as well. Help them express their thoughts and their feelings and their ideas in an intelligent, smart way, with the proper argument. Express not just thoughts, feelings also, and emotions. And once that is done, all the elements of effectiveness, of efficiency, of productivity, of success, of, of thriving and growing will be available.